Hey guys, this is Comic Uno, and today I'm doing a topic video on uh, thoughts on the Cloak and Dagger Freeform show, and also a fan casting for the show. Uh, so, um, this was actually recommended by, let's get their name, recommended by Lucia M. So if you want to go check out their channel, in the description below there will be a link. And if you guys have any recommendations for future topic videos, please let me know in the comments below. If I answer them, that means that in a couple of weeks it'll either be on Comic Uno, which is usually Friday I have them up with my comic book reviews, or Comic Frontline, which I usually have those videos up on either Sunday or Monday. Uh, so be sure to recommend away. But uh, today's topic is thoughts on the Cloak and Dagger freeform show and fan casting. So thoughts on the show, um, it's interesting because they actually announced this show like six years ago. Um, I was there at the New York Comic Con panel when they announced all these new shows that they never did, but they actually did do. Um, so they announced AKA Jessica Jones which ended up being Jessica Jones on Netflix. But they originally they were planning for an ABC show. Um, then you had the Mockingbird show, which is like going to be a college-type ABC family show. Totally, you know, now made it a little older. And you have the spinoff from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Most Wanted, which is going to be the new Mockingbird show. And now you have Cloak and Dagger, which was originally announced. And, uh... Hulk was also announced during then, uh, so far no Hulk show, but maybe she Hulk show in the future, I would love to see that. Uh, but yeah, Cloak and Dagger, I think, are interesting characters. Now, for me, I've never read their actual series. I've always seen them in Ultimate, you know, the Ultimate Universe or guessing in a comic. Never actually, like, read their own comic because um, they're they're a little dated now. But um, I, I like the characters. I like that these characters kind of come from different worlds. They find each other. Um, they're runaways and... First they become friends and, and then they find um, romance uh, with each other. So I like the concept and I think it fits, uh, you know, the, the themes that we get to see with Freeform slash ABC Family. Like Switched at Birth is a very similar type story. Um, not romantic, but you get to see two characters from different worlds come together. Uh, so I'm interested in that. And uh, character or actors I would really like to see play these characters for Cloak. Um, I would really like to see uh, Tyler James Williams, who played um, Chris from Everybody Hates Chris, and also um, one of the characters from Walking Dead. I don't even remember his name. He died a while ago. So, Noah. Noah. I think he would be an interesting cloak. Because uh, I would like to see them maybe be, like, seniors in high school or college age. So a little older than you know, high school students. Uh, and then for Dagger, I would like to see, um, from Free Little Liars, uh, Sasha, I'm not going to pronounce her last name right, uh, Peters, Peters, I want to say. It's spelled P-I-E-T-R, or T-E-R-S-E. Uh, so I, I would really like to see her because she is a lot younger than, than the other Pretty Little Liar actors because she actually does play her age, um, which is interesting. She auditioned for Pretty Little Liars when she was like 13. Uh, so it would be kind of cool. They're around the same age, those two actors, and I think they could fit those roles very well. So um, those are the actors I would like to see. And uh, I think it would just be really interesting to kind of see this runaway dynamic and like I said, I love the idea of two people from two different worlds colliding together um, and becoming friends and uh, and, ha and seeing that they have a lot in common. So curious to see what they're going to do with the show. Those are people I would, uh, you know, have a fan cast for and, and would like to see on the show. Other characters I would really like to see, maybe that they could integrate the Runaways in some way into the show. I'm waiting for, some, for them to do something with the Runaways. Uh, if the show does really well, maybe Marvel will add some more teen shows to Freeform, which I, again, been waiting a long time for Freeform to utilize ABC Families, or, I'm sorry, Marvel to utilize ABC Family or Freeform. Uh, so those are my thoughts. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think. Uh, who would you like to see cast as Cloak and Dagger? This is Comic Inno. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, scripture below, there are links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. I'll see you guys later. Bye.